going everyone? It's Keith here on a Sunday morning and I'm heading down to the allotment quickly to uh, finish off putting the cover on the polytunnel and plant our peas. So I'll see you in a second. Uh, Matt and I came down yesterday and um, we started doing the polytunnel cover as you can see over there and we're not quite finished yet. I also came down this morning to um, start planting some of the peas that we have at home. Uh, we planted at home. Um, if you follow me on Instagram, and if you don't, you should go check out my uh, Instagram page. Um, we planted some peas a while ago and they have gotten really long and they actually need to, they should have been in the ground last week basically. But with all the snow, we couldn't really get that done. So we came down yesterday, uh, started building um, a frame for them and that's the most important thing this morning for me really is to get those in. Um, if I don't have time to finish the polytunnel that's uh, not too much of an issue because we can just do that next weekend. So there are the frames that we started building yesterday. I'm just going to finish them off. Um, they are probably going to be a bit short than what we actually need in the long run but we haven't got time to uh, figure something out to make them taller. So this is going to do for now and we can always um, sort of extend it once we need to or just train the peas to grow in the way uh, we want. So I'm going to get started with that and uh, show you the progress as I go along. But I'm basically just using some plain twine um, and some bamboo sticks. Uh, we've just made a sort of triangular frame that's a real standard sort of um, shape. You'll see those you know in loads of gardens and allotments. I'm just going to reinforce the whole thing now Put like a little cross beam over the top and then put some uh, side supports along um, the, the height of it and I'll also use some string going across for the peas to, to, to climb up against. Okay, so basically I'm just going to make a hole, uh, pop the peas out of the trays and plant them in. I might just go around afterwards and sort of wrap some string just to support them up. <clears throat> Okay, so I've got all the peas in and um, I'm not 100% sure they are actually uh, going to survive to be honest. They were way too leggy and um, they should have been in the ground a couple of weeks ago. Uh, I put a whole bunch of string around them, hopefully that'll, you know, give them a bit of support. I'm not going to water them because the ground's quite uh, wet already and it's supposed to rain a bit later on today anyway. So. I suppose the best we can do is see what happens. You know, it's still quite early in the season for peas, so we've got plenty of time to plant more, and we've got loads more space to plant more. So we probably will plant um, another uh, bunch of peas, and hopefully we'll be able to get those in the ground a lot quicker, and they'll have a better chance of surviving. So um, we'll see how that goes. So that's it for today, everyone. Um, the polytunnel is pretty much almost there. We just need to hang the doors, and uh, it's getting there really we after that we just have to put the shed in and you know start planting more things basically so we've got our peas in or the first set of peas at least um, and we'll probably do more of those like I said and uh, pretty soon we'll be able to transplant the chilies into the polytunnel because that's uh, not chili sorry uh, the peppers uh, the chilies we have are, are okay to be outdoors in sort of the UK climate uh, <clears throat> after that well coming up soon basically we'll be able to start planting loads more more stuff sort of come April time um, so we'll be busy doing that basically. Um, on another note, I have got a brand new camera to make these videos and I'm still trying to get used to it. So the sound might be a bit weird in the first couple of videos and 
it's really bright today and I don't really know how to control the settings on this camera that well but I wanted to sort of get down here and you know show you guys a bit of progress so you can kind of see where we are um, and that's basically it for today hope you guys enjoyed today's video you know hopefully when when the weather gets a bit better and once we've got stuff a bit more sorted on the allotment the content's going to become a lot more consistent a bit more better you know it's kind of a bit hit and miss at the moment you know with the weather and just being busy and that sort of thing so um, uh, if you want to carry on watching these videos hit that subscribe button and I will see you guys next week enjoy the rest of your week see you later